the second question part b draw triangle a double prime b double prime c double prime the image of a prime b prime c prime under a reflection in the line y is equals to x under a reflection in the line y is equals to x so the first thing will be to identify the line y is equals to x which is that line this is the line so let's draw that line y is equals to x The line that passes through the center, through the center of this uh, axis, exactly at the center of this axis, that is the line y is equals to x. So that line should. That line should pass through that point so the line i'll make this one a little bit thicker that line that passes through the center should make the line to be a bit that is the line I'll try to make the line to be a little bit darker so that line is the line y is equals to x the line that passes through the center of the axis so the line should pass through the center of the x and the y axis and this is why it passes you can see it passes through the the middle of this axis that line is the one that is y is equals to x so this is the line that one now is the line that you're supposed to use to reflect to reflect uh okay, part b the object or the image that you've already obtained that is a prime b prime c prime so we reflect a prime b prime c prime and our reflection in the line y is equals to x so let's go there so we look at a a prime let's see where a prime is a prime is here when that one is reflected along this line and this one will act as the mirror line the distance between the object point to the mirror line should be equidistant uh, to the distance from the mirror line to the image let me make that unclear the distance between the object point to the mirror line and the distance between the image point to the mirror line should be same should be equal should be equidistant so this distance here a the mirror line is here so the point should automatically be somewhere here it should be equidistant one important thing that is supposed to know is that uh, when a point is reflected along this line y is equals to x there is a behavior and this one will help you to simplify your working the points are reversed they are interchanged for example uh, this point that is a negative 4 that is a prime is negative 4 3 that point will turn to the other way around 3 negative 4 3 negative 4 so I want to make it clear here so let me write it down so i'm going to insert another page here so let me insert a page that i mean 
that you should note this reflection in the y axis in the line y is equals to x a point a b reflected along that line y is equals to x will be b a the points the x and the y coordinates will be interchanged so in this case we have uh, a prime a prime is negative 4 3 so when reflected get a double prime that will be 3 negative 4 b prime and this uh, b prime is uh, negative 3 1 that one will be b double prime it will be 1 negative 3 then c prime that was a negative 1 2 that one will be c double prime 2 negative 1 so that is how we reflect that point without necessarily having to construct that is how you simplify the whole working reflection in the y is equal to x the points the x and the y coordinates are reversed or interchanged so going back to the graph if you want to plot these therefore and to bring it here so this one will be simplified uh, like this so um, take this zero line here so we shall have um, a is negative 4 3 that will be uh, 3 negative 4 3 negative 4 it will be here that is where we have a double prime then for b b prime is uh, negative 3 1 negative 3 1 that will be 1 3 is negative 3 1 it will be 1 negative 3 1 negative 3 to be there b double prime then c negative 1 2 it will be 2 negative 1 be there c double prime therefore um, as you can see a is there a prime after being reflected along that line y is equals to x and this is the line this is the line y is equals to x a prime a double prime will be there three negative four then b prime is negative three one uh, when that one is reflected it will be here it will be one negative three the points are interchanged you notice that the distance between these are uh, for example b prime to the mirror line and then uh, from the mirror line to the image point that distance should be the same should be equidistant then c is a negative one two when the points are interchanged and reflected along this line as opposed to x it will be two negative one so that is simply how you uh, do that reflection so let us uh, join the points let's join the points now That is uh, B double prime, C double prime. Let me join the other. So 
So I want to join a prime, a double prime, c double prime now. So there it is. Then you join B double prime, A double prime. So there the triangle is, uh, triangle A double prime, C double, uh, B double prime, and C double prime is there. So that is the image of um, triangle A prime, B prime, C prime under a reflection. The reflection in the line Y is equals to X. So